These are the new wheels. It's a 15 by 10 US Indy mag. You can see right there. This is a real deal aluminum one. We took it out to um, Andrew's powder coating with the idea to get like a Dow 7 look, like the old magnesium look, uh, late 60s, early 70s. And they did this in old brass. So this is what it looks like. So we're going to try them on. See if they fit. This part of the fender we're going to have to cut because as you can see you can't get the slicks on and off um, without deflating them. So until we get this handled I'm going to have to deflate the slick to get it on. These are actually uh, tube type DOT slicks from m and and for the street we're going to run um, the ultralights that came with the car. These are considerably lighter. Like this is just weighs nothing and this weighs a ton because it's you know, 30 years older. All right, so there we go. This area here, since the car has no brakes on it, the brake cat's probably gonna be an eighth inch, maybe maybe more. That'll bring the tire right out to the fender. So let's get the front one done too. Again, this is a heavier wheel and tire combo, but looks pretty cool. It's based on the 60s, you know, spindle mount stuff. But we think it looks kind of cool, so. All right, so here we go. Rollers that won't go flat. <laughs> 